with Mr Declan Kearney as Deputy Chairperson of the Committee for Agriculture, Environment and Rural Affairs. The nominating officer of Sinn Féin, Mr Martin McGuinness, has nominated Ms Kevin Archibald to fill the vacancy with effect from the 27th of May 2016. I have also received the resignation of Mrs Sandra Overend as Deputy Chairperson of the Committee for the Executive Office. The nominating officer of the Ulster Unionist Party, Mr Mike Nesbitt, has nominated Mr Danny Kennedy to fill the vacancy with a fact from the 27th of May 2016. I have also received the resignation of Mr Trevor Lunn as Deputy Chairperson of the Audit Committee. The nominating officer of the Alliance Party, Mr David Ford, has nominated Ms Kelly Armstrong to fill the vacancy with a fact from the 27th of May 2016. The first item of business is a motion to suspend standing orders. 21. Clerk, please read the motion. That Standing Order 21 be suspended for the 31st of May 2016. Moved. Before we proceed to the question, I would remind members that this motion requires cross-community support. The question is that the motion standing on the order paper be agreed. All those in favour say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. The ayes have it. The next item of business in the order paper is a motion regarding committee membership. As with similar motions, it will be treated as a business motion and there will be no debate. Clark, please read the motion. That Mr Gordon Lyons replace Mr Peter Weir as a member of the business committee. I call Mr Trevor Clark to move the motion. <clears throat> Moved. The question is that the motion standing on the order paper be agreed. All those in favour say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. The ayes have it. The next item of, on the order paper is a motion on appointments to the Assembly Commission. As with other similar motions, it will be treated as a business motion and there will be no debate. I should remind members that standing orders require that such a motion would be approved with cross-community support. Clark, please read the motion. That in accordance with Standing Order 79, the following shall be appointed to be members of the Assembly Commission. The Speaker, ex officio, Mr. Jim Wells, Mr. Alex Maskey, Mr. Ross Hussey, Mr. Alex Atwood, and Mr. Stuart Dixon. Call Mr. Robin Swan to move the motion. Moved. The question is that the motion standing on the order paper in the names of members of the Business Committee be agreed. All those in favour say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. The ayes have it. The next item of business is the motion on the membership of statutory committees. Clark, please read the motion. That in accordance with Standing Order 49.3, the membership of statutory committees as detailed in NIA 1 forward slash 16 to 21 be approved. Call Mr. Robin Swan to move the motion. Moved. The question is that the motion standing on the order paper in the name of the members of the business committee be agreed. All those in favour say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. The ayes have it. The next item of business is the motion on the membership of standing committees. Clark, please read the motion. That in accordance with Standing Order 52.3, the membership of standing committees as detailed in NAA 2 forward slash 16 to 21 be approved. Call Mr. Robin Swan to move the motion. Moved. The question is that the motion standing on the order paper in the name of members of the business committee be agreed. All those in favour say aye. aye. Contrary, no. The ayes have it. The ayes have it. Item three on the order paper, the adjournment. The question is that this assembly be now adjourned. The assembly is adjourned.